Hey everybody, Joseph here, and welcome back to another NHL 22 franchise with the Seattle Kraken episode here. And uh, coming off our fourth Stanley Cup in a row. And I think this year um, that streak will more than likely probably end. Um, you know, just because, well, there's only one reason why I think it could not, but I think it will be. Um, it's because our our head coach retired. Um, he has been with us since our first Stanley Cup win. So he brought this team five Stanley Cups. And he brought them four in a row. And now he retired. And it's really unfortunate that I didn't, you know, get to see his, his stats and everything. Because I don't know when he's going to retire, you know. I mean, they let us, they let you know when he retires, but that's it. You know, you, you can't see your head coach's, you know, stats and awards he's done for the team. You know, like wins, losses, overtime losses, cups and all that shit. They don't show it because EA is not that smart. You know, that's, that's the one thing I'd like to see because he's, he was here for, you know, about like nine or 10 years he was with this team. So, and he brought us five Stanley Cups. So, of course, I'd like to see his stats over the years, you know? But no, EA is really stupid, so. Um, and there is some new faces on the team. And there's also some trades that have to happen. <laughs> um, so I'm starting this uh, just before the preseason. And let's just go ahead right now and take a look at the team. I'll show you guys right now. Um, all the lines are the same except for the fourth line. We got a new guy in there. I can't pronounce his name, but here he is. His name is Carol. Oh my god. Okay, and now with him on the team, every line is a plus five. And I did find the head coach that matches La Flamme, um, which is good. It's literally the exact same coach as we had for. You know all that stuff right so everything's fine carry cycle efficient balanced except laflamme prefers don't block but whatever all right whatever um defensively um we got some growth finally out of mr freeze here so it looks like him on the third pairing last year actually helped somehow um and then sims and rycroft the same how looks the same course Ross and Eric they're the same they won't start to drop off for another three years maybe four years I don't know we'll see what happens and then the net um, Lander is in the AHL he's getting traded away um, I did I did uh, sign a goalie in free agency um, because I'm, I'm thinking like oh shit I need a backup goalie yeah I don't because I have this guy right here Igor Nikulin um, so an 80 overall, medium elite backup goalie. So I have two elite goalies now on the team. And that's just fantastic. And here are the scratched. Nelson, Hicketts, and then this guy, McKinley. And then go the goalie in the AHL and then Lander as well. Um, I don't think I'm going to give up Hicketts. I really don't. I'm not 100% sure if I will or not. I um, mean, he is 79. He's... You know, he's been in the NHL for two years now, and, uh, you know, I'm just not seeing growth out of him, so maybe it's time to part ways. I'm really not too sure on that one. I do have Elliot in the AHL as well, right? A little elite. Um, but I'm just, I don't know, man, All right? This enforcer, little elite enforcer, you bet your ass I'm gonna get him on the team when he's available. <laughs> 100%. We do got this guy. Sam. I totally forgot about He's listed as depth. So I'm going to... He can stay on the second line. I totally forgot about him. So he is the sniper that can come up and take that spot. Um, I guess we could see right now if he fits on that fifth or the fifth line. Fourth line. If it's still a plus five, that's actually amazing. I will gladly take that. An 18-year-old rather than a 28-year-old, right? Um, so why don't we just go ahead and do that quickly? I just want to see if he, he works on the line. And if he doesn't, then, well, shit. Um, even if it goes down to a plus three, I don't really give a shit. So, 
Well, I just have to sit back and wait. <laughs> Are you serious? Ah! Damn it! Alright, I can just send down Hicketts. Fuck you, Hicketts. Get back in the AHL where you belong, boy. Clearly, that's where you belong, because uh, you ain't doing shit. You ain't doing shit. You've barely grown, man. You've barely grown. You're not even 80 overall yet. Unbelievable. So, you know what? Bowie, get your ass out of there. Get your goofy ass out. He left wing is a left wing. Hicketts. Get your goofy ass in there. I mean, you're, uh, yeah, whatever. Do I have a playmaker just chilling somewhere? I do. That's not gonna work. Oh, it probably shouldn't. I mean, none of these guys are gonna be in the NHL, so they're just there for the uh, AHL or AHL, yeah. <laughs> So let's see if this guy works. If he works, I'd be awesome. He was 27. My bad. Uh, where are you? You're a center, right? He is not a center. Please work. Please work. Uh, I mean, he does work. He just brings it down to that. <laughs> is it? Is This is the problem right here, right? Yeah, it's Nicholson. It's Nicholson. I do want him on the team. He loves the fourth line. So that's actually kind of insane how he loves the fourth line. Hates the second line. That's good to know. And uh, yeah, so it's pretty much the third or fourth line for him. So I guess he could stay there. And then I can just go out and find a fourth line power forward who works on the fourth line. Um, but now that we got a new coach, now I have to sim like, you know, a month in a bit. So then the scouts can scout players under the head coach theme or whatever, right? So it's going to take a while for that to happen. Um, but the fourth line, I don't really give a shit if it's plus five, plus three, um, and all that stuff. So a uh, plus two is fine by me. I don't really care. Like, I'm, I'm not going to get rid of a medium elite 18-year-old. It's just not going to happen. Obviously, I'm going to get rid of, well, the 91 overall 27-year-old, right? And these guys don't really fit anywhere. Um, I'm not nice. Nelson might fit on the fourth line. Um, I haven't really exactly checked that. So I guess we could check it right now and see what's up. But yeah, it goes up to a plus three. But, you know, once again, I'm looking for a younger power forward. All right, just the way it is. Um, I wouldn't mind a, uh, <laughs> I mean, I should probably think about getting a, uh, you know, a second line playmaker of some sorts for that second line. But I mean, why, right? A second line full of snipers? Like what did they do last year? F 51 goals on the second line. Like, and they, with the Coyotes, he's had two 60-plus goal seasons. Three, never mind. Three 60-goal seasons with Arizona. He was on the first line, obviously. Um, if I put him on the first line, I easily could do that, too. Um, so I might want to do that for this year. Just because Angle is... You know, he's listed as a third-line sniper, so maybe I should put him... You know what, I'm going to put him on the first line and just see what he does. Um, and put him over there. And then Angle is a third line sniper, yeah, but if I do this, then... Oh, <laughs> I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. No, Rupert's staying right there. Rupert is staying right there. So I'm going to go back. Nelson is coming back off. I'm going to put uh, Nicholson back there. I don't... Uh, I want to keep Nicholson. I mean, you know, he's, he's 25, so come on, man. And then defensively, we're just, we're, we're absolutely fine for for defense. I'm not going to touch anything. This is, once again, I haven't touched anything in the defensive department yet. I'm just going to leave it the way it is, because that's what it was for last year. And, uh, yeah, so. Other than that, we are good to go. 
Um, so I'm going to sim, you know, a solid couple of months and then we'll come back and then we'll find some trades to trade those guys away along with, you know, getting a, uh, you know, better uh, fourth line here, kind of, sort of, or, you know, yeah, all right. Maybe find a better second line sniper. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so anyways, uh, let's just go ahead and uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, and here we are. So simmed about two and a half, three months, something like that. And uh, 26 and 10 record. The best, man. The best. <laughs> Ross, Way, Ross Ray leading the way with 57 points. Outstanding. Good for him. That's not what we're here for. We are here pretty much for a <clears throat> fourth line power forward to see if we can we can get that uh, you know that plus two up to a uh, you know a plus three or some shit like that or a plus uh, five or whatever right you know what I mean so oh round one there we go. Uh, if we can't get it, then we can't get it. It is what it is. I'm not gonna fucking cry about it like a little bitch. So, uh, yeah, man. So let's just go ahead and see what's out there. I would like uh, Byzantine here, a nice high franchise power forward. Um, <laughs> I know he fits on the fourth line. Um, so, you know what? I am definitely gonna try and get this guy. Uh, I mean, who wouldn't? High franchise. All right, trade value all maxed out. And uh, yeah, I got the trade value for it. I do, I do, I do. Whereas there's one, there's two, and there should be one more somewhere. Uh, uh, McKinley, right, McKinley. I got, look look at my list. There's McKinley, beautiful. Um, obviously trade is uh, disapproved. That is probably not even gonna go through at all. Um, so now let's go to the goalie. Where are you at? Where's the goalie? Really? That goalie is a... He's an, he's an 87 overall. So how... Oh my god. This game is really fucking garbage, man. How does an 87 overall goalie have zip trade value? It just makes no sense at all. Like, but yet, the goalies who haven't played yet have that high overall. I mean, trade value, like, really? Come on, man. That's just stupid. So, alright. Well, fuck that goalie. Um, since Nicholson is the fourth line of power forward, I gotta throw him in there as well. And now, I gotta take the players back. So, this ain't gonna be, uh... How many players do I gotta take back? One or two. I like, gotta take four back or three. No, three back, right? Takashi. Yep, gotta take three back. Can I squeeze a trade pick in there? That'd be dope. I ain't getting that first round pick. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, it's still not going through. <laughs> they don't want to give them up. Alright, I'm not gonna bother then. <laughs> Yeah, they don't want to give him up, and I wouldn't want to either, man. I wouldn't want to either, so. It is what it is. <laughs> um, another power forward. It's not guaranteed to fit on the fourth line, so. There we go. Fourth line, power forward, 90 overall. It says he's scouted four bar on the fourth line. So let's go ahead and uh, get this motherfucker. I can trade up. I can trade him straight up for Nicholson just right away. So let me go ahead and do that right quick, Nicholson. Oh, I can't. Ooh, nope. One other person has to go in there, and that is gonna be not not those not those two. It's gonna be McKinley will go in there as well. Yeah, trade disapproved. Blah blah blah. I'm aware of that. I kind of expected that. It is what it is. That's why we take Jared McCann. <laughs> so we take Jared McCann back. Any um, first round picks? You have our first round pick. Okay. Well, I'll take yours in return. Yeah, that's what I thought. Boom. So 
McKinley is gone, so it leaves with just Nelson and uh, Moist. <laughs> Whatever that guy's name is, man. <laughs> Ah, uh, beautiful. Is he a center? He was a center. Okay. Plus five. Hoo hoo! Let's go, baby! Ow! What? How does that go to a plus three? He's a center! Or is it just glitched out? It might be just glitched out. I don't know. So now, since we're here, it's time to get rid of the... Uh, other two players the other two players and right Nelson yeah Nelson and this motherfucker so we gotta find homes for these bastards actually wait a second 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 hold the phone wait a second wait a second I just want to see if he is if it actually is a plus five No, it's a plus three. So since, okay, so I go like this, now it's a plus five. It, excuse me, EA? How? So that's fine like that. Okay, so now it's fine, okay. So we got a natural center power forward, which is beautiful, 90 face offs, holy shit. And uh, yeah. But if I go like that, it goes to plus three? Like, I know they're playing their actual spots now, but no, yeah, okay, whatever. That goes to a plus three, that's not good. <laughs> but yeah, so wow, he loves the team. I mean, I, I would assume he would, he's, you know. But now he's gonna like, be absolute shit. But yeah, he loves the fourth line. He doesn't want to play anywhere else. Like, literally does not want to play anywhere else. Yeah, I could put him on that first line. Um, which, you know, obviously I would love to do. But then... Yeah, no, alright, that's not happening. <laughs> so we got a 90 overall to stay on the fourth line for the rest of the run. Um, but obviously I can put him on special teams. Which, you know, I will be more than gladly to do that. Um, is that him right there? Stortini? Is that his name? It is. Okay. Well, no, you're going on the first line, buddy. You don't uh, you don't belong on the second line. Um, I don't know why you're there. You're only 7-9 overall, but uh, may as well. There you go. Keep the plus 5 everywhere there. Um, I guess Shane Wright can no Shane Wright cannot do that. That's that that's not allowed. Um, he should not be there. So uh, yeah, man. Who else doesn't belong? Let's put you right there, and then put Eric on that power play line as well because Eric's a fucking beast apparently on the power play. So that drops down to a plus three. But why wouldn't I? Look what Eric's done on the power play points, man. Oh, he wasn't on the power play this whole season. Fuck, Eric. I'm so sorry. Fuck. Uh, fuck. My bad, man. Shit. Shit. My bad, man. All right. So what I do want to change is the defensive core. I want to get a second pairing defensive defenseman, and that's Sims. A second pairing defensive defenseman, which... Okay, I guess Freeze can go up there now, since that's fine. Okay, so a third pairing defensive defenseman? That might be kind of hard to find, because I have never found a exact third pairing defensive defenseman. Um, so what will work here, obviously, is a third pairing defensive defenseman and, uh, all lines defensive defensemen, so. If we don't find one, then we don't find one. Simple as that. Not a big deal. Not the, not the end of the world. And, uh, yeah, so. 
Let's see, who do we have here? <laughs> we found one right away. Hector Felino of the Detroit Red Wings. Okay, cool. Yeah, all defensive parents, Heskinen, now you're garbage, buddy. So, all right. That is the lowest trade value I have ever seen for a defensive defenseman. <laughs> All right, cool. So now we are going to give them Sims. That should be one for one. Oh, yes, it is. Detroit is a good team. So I'm giving them even a better defenseman back, which they must be happy about that. But if that's the case, I want your two first round picks. Just the way it is, man. You, you can't give me that? You're a bunch of fucking pricks, man. There you go. All right, so now he's off the team, Sims. Oh God, why is my nose so itchy, man? Especially on the inside. Fuck, that's a pain in the ass. Um, so Sims is gone. It's unfortunate to uh, t to see Sims go. You know, he brought us like two Stanley Cups, pretty much. Um, hopefully this does work. Yeah, plus three. So it was a plus five, or no, it was a plus one, my bad. Now it's a plus three. So now I can make the switch anytime, but that goes to a plus two. Ah, how about with Eric? Yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> so there we go. So now we still got Nelson and the other guy to trade away for, you know, a first round pick and everything. And um, let's just see what's up there now. And then we can uh, continue the sim. And uh, yeah, so I love having, um, you know, this is the first time ever I've had all four lines plus five other than my offline franchise but it would be nice to get all plus five for here as well so all seven lines are plus five could you imagine that shit um i don't know why freeze and rycroft aren't like that you know they both prefer the second and first pairing so i don't know why they're not a plus five uh, maybe it's because they're not on their right side because rycroft is a left defenseman oh that's probably why and the camden freeze is a left defenseman as well so that is the problem with that. That's probably why. Which. Oh my god. I am the greatest general manager in fucking history. Holy Shiza Beniza. Look at that. Oh my god. Wow. I am the best. Oh my god. All seven lines are plus five. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right, and we are back. So, end of the year, we finished with a record of 62, 18, and 2. And the first round, we got the 39, 38, and 5 St. Louis Blues. Um, I'm not going to laugh at that record because they're here for a reason. Anything can happen. But we should destroy them. Simple as that. We should easily destroy them. I'm not going to look at the team stats. Actually, yeah, I will. I'm not looking at the player stats. Okay, there we go. Obviously, we're first in the entire league. Yeah, another one of those. I forgot to take a look at the awards. Um, four point. So pretty much, I would say round up to five, but it's not above 4.95, so you can't round it up. So 4.9 goals a game. We are allowing just under three goals a game, which is third for the league. Okay, okay. And I'm not going to look at anything else. I don't care about the power player penalty kill. Ross Ray. First on the team, 121 points. LaFlam 105. Eric at 97 points. Yeah, see, Eric would have had easily 100 plus points, but I forgot to put him on the goddamn first line power play. <laughs> Shit. My bad, Eric. And everyone else did fine. Yeah, Sniper should score 47 goals. You got 51. 51, man. 51. I mean, you got 28 with Ottawa and then the 23 on the fourth line, so that's not bad, but 
Yeah, if he, you know, I don't want to keep him on the fourth line, but that's where he belongs. He belongs on the fourth line. But he's got some power play time, so 17 points on the power play. Matthews, Ronning, Lambert, Rycroft, Angle on the uh, what, second line now, right? I demoted him to the second line. Maybe first line was too much for him, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, 51 points, so I'm probably going to bring him up to the first line next year. Just because, because I know he can grow. I know he can grow. I know he can. He has no power play time either, right? He does not have power play time. Shit. Whatever. It's fine. And that's that. So now I'm not even going to bother taking a look at the teams. I'll take a look at the team if we make it to the Stanley Cup final. So uh, let's just go ahead and uh, start her right up. I did not check the goalies. Oh my god, I didn't check the goalies, which I don't really give a shit, but whatever. I want to, can I check the awards or I can't, right? I can't check the awards. Shit! That's fine. I'll check them next year. Uh, okay, let's check the goalies. Barnes, 890 here percentage, and the backup, Nikulin, 888. Oh boy. Oh boy. I could have signed a, you know, I mean, I could have kept that 87 overall, 87 overall goalie, but 4,000 minutes? God damn, Barnes. <laughs> well, I mean, Barnes won us the cup last year pretty much, so. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and do this. Get into the sim, 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 sim. Oh, that's good. All right, let's in the first four games. Let's see what's up. 5-0 win, 7-2 win, 6-1 win, 5-3 win. Beautiful. Yeah, we shouldn't, we shouldn't, win. yeah, I know, I know. We shouldn't have losses in game to St. Louis, and we didn't, so. I'll take that. The LA Kings in the second round for the second year in a row, I do believe. Go ahead and sim. 7-4 win, 2-1 overtime win. Yikes, okay. 5-2 win, 4-3 win, okay. So two sweeps to begin the player off. The, I cannot speak. Two sweeps to begin the playoffs. There we go. Dallas Stars, third round. They've always got us, brought us trouble. So 4-1 win, 2-1 win. Beautiful, beautiful. Now we're going to Dallas. 3-2 win, 4-3 win. Wow. 12-0. Holy shit. Ooh, the Islanders. Ooh. 5-4 win, 4-3 win, 6-5 win. <laughs> no way! Are we gonna go sixteen and zero? <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! No, I meant to go in and watch it. No, I pressed options. No. Son of a bitch. Okay, either way. That is five Stanley Cups in a row. We just swept the whole entire playoffs, 16-0, and, and also all seven lines are a plus five. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> wow. Well, before I forget, it's 420, by the way. Um, I got to take a picture of said lines. Ross Ray leading the way. Which makes sense because it rhymes, so uh, it makes sense that he led the way. Yeah, I gotta take a picture of these lines, man, because I'd be I'd be really dumb not to. So let me just take a picture of these lines, and yeah, I know my phone is badly damaged at the back. I don't know where that where the hell my phone cases are. So, oh my god, that's just filthy. I'm definitely keeping this team together for next year. Holy shiza, Beniza, man. 
But then again, I would assume Matthews is dropping off. Yeah, he's a 92 now. That's fine. He still works on that second line, man. Um, but I do have a second line sniper, right? Uh, <laughs> nope. But that's going to happen for next year. I'm going to leave it like that. So, actually, I will go like that. So once Matthews goes, I need to find a second line sniper. <sighs> Shit. Rupert can't do it. It just brings it down so much, man. It just works with all of them there, you know? Like, I don't, I don't know how it works, but it works. So, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So there you guys have it. Five Stanley Cups in a row. Um... And uh, six Stanley Cups for franchise history. Next year, hopefully I don't forget, take a look at those awards and see all the Stanley Cups there, baby. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Anyways, thank you all for watching. My name is Joseph. Hope you all enjoyed. And as always, I will see you all in the next one.